So let me just welcome you all. So my distinguished guests, guests of no distinction, guests of dubious distinction, friends, family, old, young, freeloaders, people I don't even know, never met before. You're all welcome. Welcome to Michaela and Callum's wedding. Something, when I was a child, my favourite book was Danny Champion of the World, Roald Dahl, the great reader, writer, sorry. Um, and it stuck with me all my life, and I've still got the book at home now, and you know, I'm 50 odd years old. And something that stuck with me, um, on the back of the book, he writes this little thing to parents, and I'll read it out exactly word for word. It says, a message to the children who've read this book. When you grow up, have children of your own, do please remember something important. A stodgy parent is no fun at all. What a child wants and deserves is a parent who is sparky. And that's stuck with me all my life. They don't want material things, they just want mum and dad and fun times. And you can make fun times really, really cheaply. It doesn't have to be in the best car or whatever. Spend time with your kids. If you're blessed with kids, enjoy them. Because before you blink your eyes, you stood up doing Father the Bride speech and it's all gone before you, you know what I mean? It's stunning, love. Are you ready to do this? Is it? You've grown. <laughs> Stunning. Nervous? Yeah. Are you? Ah, you're right. Let's do it. So to be chosen as one of his best men alongside Mark and Rob today, I feel, uh, feel very, very privileged. Um, obviously, it came a little bit sooner than we were all expecting, I think. I think we were possibly expecting next year. But I think the reason, we know, the reason that happened is he wanted to have hair on his uh, wedding photos. <laughs> <laughs> so... Uh... <laughs> Thank you for agreeing to be my wife, uh, my partner in crime, and my jelly top. <laughs> I have so much to thank you for, and I love you with all my heart. <sighs> Stop it. Hold on. Come on. <laughs> I'm sure everyone here would agree with me that you look absolutely stunning today. I know I say you've done a fantastic job. Be my wife so far. <laughs> so, for that, ladies and gentlemen, can you please raise the toast to my wife, to Michaela? Michaela. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And commitment to you. And commitment to you. Wear it with love. Wear it with love. And as a sign of all we have promised. And as a sign of all we have promised. And done this day. And done this day. We'll support them through everything they do in their life. We think he's a great guy. We think they're going to be very happy. I think they're prosper together because he kind of banks off. He's learnt to not deal with Michaela when she's tired, just to ignore him. <laughs> so all I say is grasp your opportunities, you guys. 
If you fail, don't matter, just have a go. That's what it's all about. We're always here to help you get back on your feet or support you. So that's kind of me done. All I need you to do now, if you could all upstand and toast the bride and groom. Bride and groom. It is my great privilege to declare that you are now and Callum, you may kiss your bride.